dinner time and there's garlic mushrooms with three different kinds of mushrooms and then crockles or soup and some gri grilled honey chicken so at the moment i've actually started trying no ooh. i've actually started making cinnamon rolls for the first time so here i've got warm milk i've got sugar cinnamon butter egg yeast and there's flour as well and then that's all the ingredients and some salt and i'm gonna try and make cinnamon rolls for the first time ever so right now i have the dough and i'm gonna knead it for a bit so the dough has risen and i'm floured the tabletop i actually don't have a rolling pin here so i'm actually using a rounded container and roll it out so really um this is what do you call it um not last minute but kind of use your equipment wisely <laughs> so right now i've got the dough rolled out i'm actually waiting for the butter to melt a little and i'm gonna put the cinnamon sugar coating in and then roll it up so now i've got the butter on the thing and i've got the cinnamon sugar and now i'm gonna roll it up it smells so good right now so now i've cut it and then i'm gonna place it on the tray and let it rise a bit and then I'll put it in the oven so i've got the cinnamon rolls or well, some uh, different levels and uh, they're on the tray and i'm waiting for it to poof and then i'll put it into the oven it smells so good so it's out of the oven right now and this is what it looks like this looks really good for a first timer of making cinnamon rolls and some of the sugar has melted, which is quite good because I put deramera sugar, deramera? Deramera sugar inside, so it's got like a little crunch. And I think it's cooked because it looks cooked, I think, kind of. But yeah, I'm going to... I've already turned off the oven, so yeah. So right now I'm making for cheddar. For, for cheddar. I'm actually making pasta. I've got tuna, mushrooms, and jalapeno sausage with tomato sauce and having it with pasta at the moment i'm at ho high station first time being at this station and i'm gonna go to sea world haven't been to sea world i've just been on line 11 line 11 um it's very new um and now the transfer at ho high to line two is freaking long and you get people that get in the way even if you said excuse me these people really seriously need to get off the path and out the way. But yeah. This interchange is really long. It's almost like Kowloon Tong. That interchange that I hate, but this one's not too bad right now. Maybe there's not that many people, but still. It's an interchange that I don't like. But yep, yeah, trying to scoot through here. And now we're going up. I'm guessing this station is quite old because it's line 2 and 911 is new so they had to combine it. So right now I am SeaWorld and this is the ship! The ship! But it's stationary. It just looks like a ship. And this is the square and I'm gonna look around for food. So yeah, this is SeaWorld. So right now I have the I've got the emirata right now and it's uh, made with uh, taco shells and it's in like a, this sauce I'm gonna try a little bit of the sauce The sauce is smoky a little bit spicy like wheaty a little bit sweet as well so this is new Oh, the spice is starting to kick in, in the throat. So at the moment, this is a special that they're doing today, which is a 88 RMB, and it's all you can eat this. So they'll just make this, and it's all you can eat. So this is the first plate, and I'm eating my this thing, which I forgot. So this is actually called the Impossible Cake. This is chocolate sponge on the bottom, and a lychee fan flan on top. It's similar to the one in the Philippines, the condensed milk, and it's 
with cream and a cherry that just dropped.